Recently, my parents have been pushing me into marriage. Is marriage necessary? Marriage is not a very sacrosanct, you know, ritual in my mind. It's, it's uh, something which is which has been evolving and has constantly evolved over the uh, centuries. And uh, I think it's also a very patriarchal institution. Uh, it's kind of a woman is given by one man to the other, which means uh, a father gives away his daughter to another man to take care of, as if the woman is incapable of taking care of herself. And uh, this old belief of marriage, which has been still continuing, uh, will obviously change as uh, women are more independent and they have a life of their own, a mind of their own, and they can think for themselves and they don't need a man to tell them what to do. So marriage is an evolving and a changing institution. So the marriage as we see today, I do not think will survive in the future. It will change. Uh, marriage has evolved in the past from a man having many wives to now most cultures only permitting one man and one wife or one man and one woman. And uh, or sometimes also it's changing to man and man and woman and woman. So there are other forms of marriages which are happening. My definition of marriage is that it is a social contract between two people who continue to stay together even when they have fallen out of love. And the reasons for this are many societal pressures. Uh, Divorce, though becoming uh, increasingly high, is still a very expensive proposition. It's not cheap. And uh, so just out of convenience, many couples stay together, though they may not uh, love each other anymore. So I believe the future of marriage is going to be when this social contract is no longer necessary. This bond is, in this artificial bond is no longer necessary. The only bond that two people need to be living and staying together is the bond of love. And as long as love is there, there is no need for a separate you know, contract like marriage to be in place. I believe this is how marriage will evolve. So I have seen many happily married couples, people who have been married for 15, 20, 25 years, 30 years, 40 years, and they're really happy. But I also believe they would have still remained together if they were not married because they are really in love and they continue to be in love even after so many years of marriage. I do not think marriage has anything to do with it. However, some people may still feel the need to have a marriage, you know, to be married and that is perfectly fine. This is, you know, what they want to do. But if it's you who do not want to be married and feel that you can live independently on your own, then I do not think there is any reason really to be married because the institution of marriage is evolving. In many cultures and societies, marriage is also kind of considered necessary because of, uh, you know, that is kind of a license to have a physical relationship or to bear children. This is also a very patriarchal system that a woman is not allowed to have physical relationship before marriage and only after she is married or she cannot bear children outside of the marriage. It is in a way a methodology to control the women kind. So this will change as the society is changing and um, I also believe that the children grow up with loving uh, parents and those parents need not be married together as long as they're loving is better they grow up in such a house than to grow up in a house where the parents are married but they're constantly fighting with each other. And to sum it all, once again, I would just say, if you feel marriage is not for you, then it's all right. I do not think uh, it is necessary at all. So if you have any feedback, any comments, please do leave them on this page. If you have a question, I'll be happy to answer it. Thank you for watching this video.